Hey Israel, it was a pleasure speaking with you earlier. Sorry, I'm just now getting to your video. Um, so all I wanted to do, I wanted to give you some value up front. Okay. And so that's what this video is for, to help give you a couple of tips so that you can increase your online digital presence so that more customers can find you and, you know, get more customers. Okay. So I have found you here. I looked up tree services and carry, and that's how I found you by clicking more businesses. And I think you're on like the second or third page. So, um, I really like your logo. I like your pictures. It looks very professional. I noticed you have a lot of five stars reviews, which is awesome. I only work with people that have good reviews. And so, um, I wanted to pull up you and your competitor. Here's your competitor, Barlet Tree Experts. As you can tell, these guys, they, they've been around for a while. They have a really high Google index. Um, Google doesn't rank uh, Facebook pages here, okay, because you're on Facebook. So I clicked on your link right here, and this is what it pulled up. It says that, uh, sorry, the page that you're looking for does not exist or is not available. So I don't know if uh, you do have a website and it's just not working. I, I don't know, but that that's just for your information. Uh, so <clears throat> your co competitor over here, these guys have a really high Google index and they also have a really high Bing index, uh, 7.64 thousand uh, in Bing index. That's a domain authority. That's the power that a website has within a certain location. So these guys, uh, first thing I, was, I want to talk about, three different things. First thing is content. So as you can tell, these guys have a ton of content on their website for mature pruning, young pruning, um, specialty pruning, palm pruning. Google wants to see at least 1,500 words to consider a, a website an authority and the domain space in your local area. Okay, so... That's why that's super important to make sure that you have a ton of content on your website. Another thing is backlinks. So you have all of these different things here. Okay. And now that's really important because 80% of people look online for services. So I think you're really missing out on like a lot of different customers simply because you don't have a web page. So that's again why backlinks are super important and why having a website is important, first of all. So backlinks, all these different things here, are really important because it builds up the internal structure of your website. So if a person is looking for a specific product or service, they can find it. For example, if they're looking for storm damage, they can come here. Um, one thing that these guys don't have is stump removal. Like if a person was on this, random person, a random Joe was on this website, they wouldn't know that this company does stump grinding because it's not on their website. And so that's another reason why it's really important to have backlinking into uh, in integrated into your website. Okay, so just as an overview again, you got uh, content, all the words on your web page. It shows Google that you know what you know, so you can help make your customers make a more informed decision whenever they decide to purchase from you. You also have the backlinks so they can find the services that they're looking for. And the final thing is citations. So as you can see here, Tree Service and Durham is like one of the closest locations for you guys. And you have the Barlet Tree Experts right there. And they have about 20 to 20, 20 to 30 different citations, okay, for your top competitors. So what is a citation, first of all, right? A citation is another website that shows your business name, your business phone number, and your operating hours, all located on a different website. And so, uh, like Yelp or Yellow Pages or BBB or um, Chamber of Commerce, all of those different ones, those are all considered citations. The reason why that's really important, really, really important, is because it shows Google that you are a reputable company. You didn't just come out of the woods one day and say, "Hey, I'm going to cut trees," but it shows that you are a reputable company that can actually. Um, that that's considered trustworthy within your uh, local local area. So again, this is a pretty cool tool I use. Um, you have a, I can pull up this comparison chart here where I can pull up all of your competitors, and I can show you exactly what citations that that they're using. Again, like Yahoo, uh, Yelp, Manta, Chamber of Commerce, BBB. Those are our most famous ones. Uh, now it takes between twenty and thirty minutes to actually set up an account with these guys. Some of them you do have to pay for, like Yelp, sometimes with Manta. 
Um, but again, that's something you can do. It takes between 20 and 30 minutes and some of them you have, you'd have to pay for. So I hope you found this information valuable. Again, one thing is content. You want to make sure that people have a ton of content onto your website. Another thing is backlinking, all of the different uh, links that they can click on so they can find your service. And finally, your citations so that you're considered a reputable company to Google. So I hope you found this information valuable. Um, if you have any questions or concerns, all you have to do is just give me a quick call and I'll be happy to help. Uh, however, uh, if you want to do this on your own, that's totally cool with me. If you need some help, all you have to do is just, again, give me a quick call or you can send me a text message if you like. My name is Brandon. You can call me or text at 704-476-6223. Have a great day. Talk to you soon.